new toys to play with today. We are uh, sporting the Jublo. I think it's Jublo. No, Jublo. 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 Yeah, today we're sporting the EVAD ones, or Evade, I think that is going to be common slang for. Uh, these are a heads up display. Absolutely brilliant bit of kit. So on the heads up display itself, right now I'm doing 25.3 kilometers per hour, which is snail's pace, of course. Uh, we're about 22 minutes into the ride. <laughs> We've only done 2.65 kilometers. And uh, yeah, the cadence is, uh, actually cadence is not on at the moment, but uh, I think I took it off by accident. <laughs> I find it less distracting to ride with this thing as well, it's looking down, takes you off the road, you have to focus, and then obviously if you're on, on the wrong screen you have to flip through it as well, which does take a little bit longer to do. However, with, uh, with these, the main screen has all the gubbins I need. If I want the rest of it, then I have to do the uh, the gestures, which is basically wave my hand across my face like a gang member. There's still some perfection to be done, I think, with the app. The interface is not 100%, but it is good. Of all the gizmos I've got, purchased, tried, played with, and all sorts, these have got to be the best. I really don't know why they're not everywhere because they are absolutely awesome. The technology behind the actual projector itself is something called Active Look, which uh, obviously they license it out. They've got their own sort of SDK and obviously developer unit as well, which you can buy for about 400 euros. Even if it does give me 12 hours battery life, that's pretty much on par with the Karoo, the Karoo 2 that is. Now it does pair with uh, Bluetooth, I'm not sure about AMP Plus. I'm sure it must do, but I would assume just Bluetooth. So obviously my cadence, which is a Wahoo, that pairs. I've got a speed, yeah, speed one as well from Wahoo, that pairs. Obviously it pairs with a mobile phone, of course, and the app. The app itself controls the whole mechanism. So essentially you're using the phone's GPS to route it on the display just here. You can get uh, Garmin applications. So if you've got one of the new Garmin's with the App Store on it, pretty much any device, I would imagine from Garmin in the last three years, probably. Yeah, probably, um, was it the Edge 530, 830, 1030, you get the idea. Okay, here we go. We are going to get a closer look at this uh, so you can see it. But as you can see, this is the uh, the inside of the glasses. 
more to the point if I can get in there that there is the projector and as you can see it uh, well the battery I'm guessing is there obviously this is the gubbins and the brains of the outfit underneath this uh, this nose pad thing here it there's a USB uh, socket which obviously is used for charging oh, crikey I ain't seen red ants for years hello mr. red ant Wow yeah so obviously there's a projector there that there's a mirror and basically it comes out of there bounces off there pushes onto the screen uh, which is uh, quite a novel little idea but as you can see it's uh, it does look the business ah uh. I really don't understand why they're not selling like hotcakes <laughs> it's just I think when you try them and then you use them you see a benefit straight away I did and uh, I think anyone else who rides them or uses them with uh, cycling they're not just used for cycling though you can use them for running too um, I think they're actually marketed for running cycling and Nordic skiing of all things yeah, so definitely the key features to take away is the 12 hour battery life bluetooth compatibility absolutely uh i don't know about the amp plus i'm sure if it was on the package i would have spotted it so i'm going to assume not but definitely for bluetooth the cadence obviously power sensors it also does power meters as well you can actually have power on the display as well so if you do have one of the uh, uh, power units for instance hooked into your Garmin it will obviously output it straight away to the heads up and you'll be able to see uh, how much power you're putting out that could be very useful for the uh, a little bit more committed out of there so have you got any thoughts on these would you buy them would you wear them would there be any use to you let me know in the comments see what you think but yeah I'm absolutely made made up on these I think they're absolutely brilliant <laughs>